So, this is it, y'all. This is New Year's Eve. 2020 is history. But the best news of all, 2021 is looking so bright that we got to wear shades. And this year, we've seen a lot. Whether it was political, whether it was an illness, whether it was here right at our own home state of Illinois. There was lots of feuds, whether it be with our governor, whether it be with our acting president, or whether it be <laughs> with the house struggles that we've had and all the repair, or when the car needed repair, and the accident that was not my fault, or the tires that was a big decision to either repair or trade. And of course, as you all know, the blue bombshell still remains parked out there. At this time, I want to say goodbye 2020, but most importantly, let's not forget. Let's learn to be kind. Let's learn that we need to respect one another. Let's learn from our mistakes. And going forward, let's treat each other with kindness. And let us treat each other with decency. Most importantly, more than anything else, I wish you good health, wealth, and lots of prosperity. I miss my grandma more than ever. She was my New Year's Eve buddy. I send this one out to her. Should old acquaintance be forgot and never brought to mind? Should old acquaintance be forgot and days of old Should old acquaintance be forgot and never brought to mind? Should old acquaintance be forgot and days of old lang syne? For old lang syne, my dear, for old lang syne, we'll take a cup of kindness yet. Days of old Lang Syne. Should old acquaintance be forgot and never brought to mind? Should old acquaintance be forgot and days of old Lang Syne? For Hey, look, here comes that 2020 New Year's train leaving, and 2021 is coming on through. Prosperity, look, there's love, peace, and harmony coming along, and baby wa engineers are waving. Happy New Year, everybody. Happy New Year. <laughs> it's 2021 by the time you see this. I wish you all good health much prosperity, much wealth, much happiness, and above all else, love. So I want to spend just a little bit of time of what we used to do back when I was growing up. They had this really cool place in Taylorville, Illinois. It was called Nashville North USA. And every New Year's Eve, 
Whispering Bill Anderson would play over there. And every New Year's Eve, we would go see him in concert. And the last time that we got to see him in concert, they had a little lunch-like thing. And I'll never forget the memories. And it was just so wonderful to see him in concert and, as always, see Grandpa chumming around with him because that's his favorite singer. And then uh, that was just the way it was. Now, as time passed, and, of course, Nashville North went by the wayside, Grandma would always stay up with me because she was like, well, if Donna's going to stay up, I'm going to stay up too. We would have our sparkling apple juice, and right now it feels, uh, apple cider, excuse me, it feels so strange to have that time to celebrate glass in the freezer. And I know I'll be the only one festing on the sparkling apple cider. Grandpa's already went to bed, and so is Peanut, so it's just me and Sammy. But I wish you well. God bless. Stay safe. And uh, for the last time in 2020, I'll get to say this. Keep your social distance. Wash your hands. When you're not washing your hands, use your hand sanitizer. But most importantly, wear your mask. God bless. And happy 2021.